Hello everyone and welcome to another one of Charlie's check-ins or lockdown lowdowns, whatever you want to call it. I hope you have had a good couple of days, whatever you have been up to. Um, how did you get on with making your new routines? I hope that was really helpful for you. So today we are thinking about escape and before you get all excited and start getting your escape gear ready, we're not thinking about breaking out of lockdown, sadly but we are thinking about how do we mentally escape and how do we keep ourselves mentally healthy. So, firstly, we need to accept and also understand that it is okay to not feel okay. And it is really important to be honest and admit that. We need to be honest with how we are feeling and share that, and it is okay to not feel okay. So secondly, when we are not feeling okay, it is really important to have some way to reset that feeling, some way to get us back on track. So this is the form of escape that we were talking about. It's a way of getting rid of that tension and helping us to mentally reset so that we are able to cope again with the stresses and strains of life and what is going on around us. So have a chat to someone in your house about what activities you do. Are you someone that reads? Do you listen to music or do you go for a walk? What is it that you do to escape? So have that conversation now. So in your routines, I hope that you've planned some time in there to do the activities that are your escape activities. These are really, really important for us, especially when we are cooped up inside for all this time. No doubt tensions in your houses have been getting a little high from time to time, and it is really important that when you feel these tensions rising, that you have some time to do your escape. And I know that some of you will be finding this particularly difficult, but also think about your parents. Parents will be finding this time tricky too. Parents are real people too, you know, and they will be feeling all kinds of different emotions, just as you will be, so look out for your parents as well. If you feel like things are getting on top of you, why don't you take some time out to do one of your escape activities? Also, why don't you ask the people in your house what their escape activities are? And if you feel like they need to do one of their escape activities, tell them that it is okay to do that. Over the past week or so, I have been reading John's account of Jesus's life from the Bible. And I have been amazed at the amount of times that Jesus took himself away from the crowds to spend time alone. And this has been really interesting for me because it shows me that if it was important for Jesus to take time away from the crowds, then it's important for me too. So what do I do to escape? Well, it is really important for me to get out of the house once a day. So I will either run or I will walk around the Coniston area. And it has been lovely bumping into some of you out and about on your daily walks too. I also listen to lots of music. If you've been walking past my kitchen and happen to catch me there, you will have no doubt seen me singing away and it's highly, highly embarrassing. I also play guitar as well. So that's another way that I escape. Also for me, uh, spending time with God and praying and reading the Bible have uh, been really good times for me. They give me real peace. And God is the most important thing in my life and he brings me the most joy. So it's been great to actually just spend time with God away from all the busyness. So have a think about what it is that is your escape. So we've had a few more jokes coming in, which is absolutely fantastic. We've got one for this video, one for the next one. Um, today's one is another Danny Birch special. Well done, Danny. This one really, really got me. So who is the knight that patrols the edge of a circle? Circumference. Absolutely classic. We have a joke from Connor Airy coming in on our next video. So do send your jokes in and we need all the jokes that we can get. So in the meantime, you guys stay safe. I will see you on Friday and make sure you escape. Well, not breaking lockdown. You know what I mean. Just find whatever it is, is your escape. Right. <laughs>